There's nothing. Unless some type of swindle. Wait, here. why King A2? Oh, we have what did he do? Oh, oh, my God. Mate. oh, oh come oh, on. Oh, oh, get him off the board. Oh, I'm done. I'm done. I'm out. I'm oh, out. I'm my done. God. That is hard. You on your own, bro. You on your own, bro. I'm out. Y'all have a good one. All right. See you, James. <laughs> no, man. That is ridiculous. Hikaru Nakamura is the defending, defending, defending speed chess champion. That's right, he has won the last four speed chess championships. His opponent in round one, David Paravian, was sure to have a difficult time ousting the number one seed. Hikaru set the tone from move one, literally, as he began with 1A3. He would be having fun and playing exotic and often very questionable openings all match long. Ultimately, Hikaru won a long match opener, but in game two, Paravian was all set to come back as he could pick up a free rook. You can also play knight c5, that's probably good there enough, it is. but <laughs> this is lights out. Knight c5, nice put five. it on the board, boom. Rook c4 check first, Hikaru pre-moving it out. Wow, there's nothing new happening there. Knight e6. I like how he's taking his time here. I got more moves. I can take the rook, <laughs> or I can check. Wait, ah, uh, yeah, 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 here oh, he cleaned. Wow. Wait a second, but he lied rook d6? He did. That was kind Why of did strange. he do that? That is insane. Mm. Look I at think he just yeah, forgot about his, Rook yeah. Six. yeah, look at oh his face. Oh my goodness. After the draw, Hikaru did not let up. He played G4 on move four to win a smashing game three, followed it up with another convincing win in game four before playing a brilliancy in game five with a Rook sacrifice. Oh, and and then you play six. Rook takes F6 and then and Bishop takes D4 four. and you're hunting. And I think he Bishop sees D4. it. Yeah, rook f1, d4, rook f6, yeah, wow. And then bishop d4, and then we're trying to go for mate here. Bishop d4, queen h7 is next, so maybe king e6. Oh, but we have queen h7. Where are you running, though? Queen h7. Queen h7. And bishop c6, oh, but bishop g, g, get him off the board. Ooh, about that sniper! There. I got the bishop in the corner <laughs> pocket! Bishop in the corner. Another Hikaru win preceded a long draw as Hikaru peeled time off the clock in a dead drawn Bishop endgame. In game eight, Hikaru played Alyekin's defense and Paravian vigorously set out to acquire his first win. Oh, resignation on All the All right, he's on the board. Oh, on the score call, the first dub. After that 16 move setback, Hikaru did close with one more win and finished the five plus one time control with a lead of seven to two. While Hikaru won the opening three plus one game, Paravian swindled him in the next game and scored his second win. Huge Maybe swindle, not. huge swindle. Yeah. I mean, both sides with won no time. Won by resignation. He resigns. Wow. He resigns. Nice Paravian had a big advantage in the third three plus one game as well. Rook up to D8. Well, Bishop D3 might hang the D pawn. There it is. He went for it. Wow, it's losing oh, no, completely. No, no, queen, queen B3. B3. Oh, my <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, Queen D4, there's King B1, which David saw, and he would have Bishop G6 there with it the hurts. discovery. But this is an insane oh, find. What a move. Bishop D3, he just, he. I think that was a practical thing Carl did there. Oh, it was very man. practical. I mean, Bishop D3 was very easy move to make. Very easy move. Another draw then set up two more wins by Hikaru before Paravian punished one of Hikaru's opening extravagances with knight takes d5. In just 10 moves, Hikaru's king was sitting on d7 in a surely lost position. I got three of them, boys. I'm not mad. Like, I'm not mad. Check. Check. You want to draw, bro? I'll take it. Like, I think you've got to get your rook on h1 involved somehow, like with h rook h3. But suddenly when knight d6 comes... Oh, yeah, this is, yeah, that's this, a this, great way to describe Scrappy. This is so Scrappy. For scrappy, me. right, Scrappy. He even managed to win this. I mean, I can't believe it, bro. can't believe it. He was getting crushed. And David refused several uh, draw offers in this game. Oh, and Knight B1, there's, there's the finish. Wow. Finishing touch. Yeah, it hurts. Yeah, that definitely hurts, bro. I was rooting for David in that game, too. What a turnaround. After this victory, Hikaru closed with two more to finish the three plus one time control with a 14 and a half to three and a half lead. In the first bullet game, Hikaru put rooks on the seventh and won a powerful initial game. But then Paravian went on a roll. He won a drawn rook end game, and then he sacked a bishop on f2 for a big attack. That's not even okay. That's what I don't understand. Whoa, and, whoa. Oh, King F2, Queen C5. Whoa. Nice counter uh -huh. shot. Nice shot there. He's, he's looking now, David, looking. I 
I like it. It Take takes Brooklyn. Ooh, hold on. Got it. Everything. Everything drops. Back to back Everything. buckets for David. Let's go. Big David. Paravian pushed on in the next game, winning a piece on move nine. B5, queen e5, check. Wait, queen oh, e6, e5? Wonder. What is this? E5? What is this? Yo, look at Icaro's face. In f4? Oh, yeah, it's man. starting to slip. Maybe hey, hold up. lightly careless oh. there from the cards. Oh, that's a good move for e1. Ugh, oh, so that's tricky. a good move to make. Oh, no. C1, oh, man. It's, Chances it's are losing. Slipping. It's equal. It's slipping, yeah. And then that's losing. It should be three, but it should be two. Queen h6. What a queen f6. Then e2 hangs, at least. Ah, you're right. You're actually right. So maybe we just take... Yo, okay, you took oh, queen h6, two. bishop f8. Yeah, that's more precise. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is insane. Queen f6 is here after... Wait. Queen eight. Oh, yeah, you can't. Takes, takes. E8. Oh, my gosh. He was down a piece. Down a piece. He was down a clean piece for nothing. And down White had a pawn f6 piece. with an attack. But it still wasn't enough against the uh, Yeah. Having stolen that point and broken a possible three-game winning streak for Paravian, Nakamura also won the next game. But then Paravian won a piece and established a big bishop on g7 as Hikaru strove for counterplay. There's nothing. Unless some type of swindle. Wait, here. why king a2? That is... Oh, we have What is he doing? Oh, my God. Me. Oh, oh, come on. Oh, oh. Get him off the board. Oh, I'm done. I'm done. I'm out. I'm oh, out. my hey, God. Jeffrey, that is hard. You're on your own, bro. You're on your own, bro. I'm out. I have a good one. All right. See you, James. <laughs> No, man, that is ridiculous. Oh, my goodness. Even Paravian was laughing at the end of that one, and in general, he seemed in good spirits. Though Hikaru won the next game, Paravian seized on his chance to score some more points against Hikaru, and he closed with two more bullet victories as the clock ran out after a 19.5, 7.5 victory for the defending champion. Champions are often perfectionists, and much like Carlson in his Speed Chess Championship opening match, Nakamura did not appear satisfied with his play, despite the big margin of victory. Nakamura advances to play Aronian in the quarterfinals of the Speed Chess Championship. Is he destined to win his fifth title in a row?